We're in a world of change. Millions of dollars are being spent every day on psychologists and psychiatrists by people who want to change their behavior or on cosmetic surgery by people who want to change their looks. They want to think differently, look differently, act differently, and be different. They want to change. God says there's going to come a time when I will overturn, I will overturn, I'll overturn it. God can overturn your life also right now if you would let him. He can change your life. He can make you different. Jesus said our problems come from within. Your problems are not without. It's not the environment of your home or the neighborhood you live in or any of those other things. The basic problem is in your heart. And it cannot be solved by these superficial remedies that we bring, like alcohol or drugs or something else. It's solved by a revolution that God brings. I will overturn it, he says. I will change you if you will let me. God said, for whosoever shall call upon the name of the Lord shall be saved. If you today call upon the name of the Lord, you can be saved. You can be made over. God will overturn your life and change the direction in which you're going right now. God will cause a revolution. You pass from death to life, from destruction to eternal life. A fantastic change, the greatest change in your whole life is not when you get married, as great as that may be. It's when you give your life to Christ and let Christ change you. From that moment on, everything else becomes different. But there are two destinations, one toward heaven and one toward judgment and hell, and you're on one road or the other. If you're on the broad road that leads to destruction and judgment, I'm asking you to change roads and go the narrow road that leads to eternal life. And that means you must come by way of the cross. It means that you must repent of your sins. And you ask, well, what do you mean by repentance? I mean that you're willing to change. Change your style of living. Change your habits. Change from the sins, the things that are wrong in your life to doing the will of God. You must be willing to do that. You may not have the ability to do it, but when you come to Christ, he'll give you the power to do it. He helps you to make the change. He helps you in the repenting. Which road are you on? When Christ returns, will he find that you have been transformed by his power? I will overturn it. I will overturn it. He will overturn your life right now. This minute, he can change you and make you a new person. 